What's up everybody, 915 Mang here, doing a video today, I got a lot of stuff to talk about, check out this dog, it's a good day to be a dog, cruising with your owner, and uh, this guy took his dog all the way like this, over the mountain, to the other side of the city, and uh, the whole time the dog was sticking his head out, so I think that was pretty awesome, and I just wanted to share that with you. It's also a good day to be me, because I got some coral. Got some coral from uh, cultivatedreef.com. Um, basically, I've ordered from them before. I've done unboxing, but I had a little bit of money. The wife gave me the go-ahead to go ahead and get some corals. So I dropped about two bills, and I'm going to show you how you can get some corals. Some of the stuff that they have right now on sale. Um, once again, it's not sponsored. I didn't get anything for free. Actually, I did because they had some... Uh, offerings on the re on the reefing forum of reef to reef and uh, I hit them up but I do want to show you my Chato reactor it's been doing good it's been working um, you can see all the Chato right here is growing I have lots of pods and uh, you know what I didn't throw this away at all I did however give it away to two reefers for the wonderful price of free and this is all just Chato from my Chato reactor that I picked up. It's from um, that reactor. I ended up buying some cheap Amazon lights, some red, blue Amazon lights. And uh, the lights themselves were like 12, 13 bucks. I'll put a link on the bottom below for you guys if you want to do something similar. It doesn't have to be, you know, anything fancy. It's just something to hold your, your Chato. And uh, I got a king size reactor. Um, I'm going to be using some. Uh, this Aquamax right here to pit up some of the frags, but check out the Chato, man. The results are right here. They don't lie. As you can see for yourself, I did give it away for free. And uh, I'm going to show you here. I'm using the NIOS Nitrate Test. I bought this uh, when they were having the sale. And uh, you know what? It's an easy, easy test to use. And uh, you can check out the liquid itself is pretty clear. I may do a how to use the video, the nitrate test kit for you guys, but uh, I just want to show you guys. Now, it's always nice to see what I get in the coral. Um, I got these from Cultivated Reef, but I want to help you get some coral for cheap. Um, and I'm going to show you, I have a lot of you guys ask me about Zoas, but you guys can go ahead and get your Zoas or whatever you're looking for. The site, uh, as you can see, I pit it all on the website there on Reef to Reef, which is who I've been uh, on lately, Reef to Reef. But you can see that they have 20% off corals right now. Hit them up. I don't know, maybe you can tell them 915 Mang sent you in the remarks. Maybe that way I can get some freebies or something like that, since I did do like a basic free commercial for them. Um, but the, some of the corals that I picked up are uh, fire, as you can see. I'm using a blue flashlight so to show you, uh, kind of save you some time and see what what you what I got. But I got some of the Iron Man A cans, which are those off on the left. I got some pink boobies chalice. At the time, uh, I did have to ask Holly, who is the female owner of Cultivated Reef. So all you female reefers out there. Support Holly on Cultivated Reef. She is a female reefer. This is her business. And I hit her up. I said, hey, you know, on the farms, you were selling the pink boobies for $50. You know, they're up at $100. Do you think I can go ahead and get it at the $50 rate that you were doing it on the farm? And so, you know what? They honored that. And I also spent uh, two something. Like I said, I didn't get nothing for free. But I bought this rainbow chalice not rainbow chalice but this rainbow monopore right there and uh this is shortly here in the tank and it's doing really good can't wait till it gets bigger you know i do have the green montipora i used to have some red monopora um i'm gonna get some of that later again because i don't know what happened to it and i do have a nice big chunk of purple idaho grape montipora but i want to show you some of the other stuff that i got too and some of these things that i've already had but, uh, for example, this Miami Vice uh, Zoa, you know, bluish with the pink centers in the center, in the middle. Really awesome. 
also have lots of Aptasia if any of you guys want any for free. But on a serious note, I did pick up some Hornets. I used to have some Hornets before, but I got some more. Because uh, the Asterina Starfish just destroyed a lot of my high-end Zoas. Now these Red Hornets, they've been out for a while, but I still like them. So I ordered myself some more. I also got... Now this is a cool thing. If you send the, them the email, which I was talking to Holly... They didn't have these blue uh, hornets listed, but I was able to get them, so that was also pretty awesome. I did pick up a little bit more SPS on this order. Um, I paid a, a nice little penny, but uh, also because of the forums, they were doing free acros, okay? So I got this one. I bought this one. I forgot the name of it. I'll give it to you here in a second. So let me go ahead and tell you what I got. I bought a Strawberry Fields uh, Acro. I got an ATL Shades of Fall, which was a bonus, which is pretty cool. Um, and then I also got a uh, Upscales um, Cloudy, which I'll have to show you in the, later on, which I really don't know the name. But I just checked out the website as I'm actually making the uh, video. And it's kind of... Uh, Kind of cool because they're selling the ATL Ultimate Rainbow Monopora, which I'm seeing right now. You have a day and 21 hours, 59 seconds, 5 seconds or whatever left for only 10 bucks. And that same uh, Cultivated Reef Strawberry Fields Acropora that I paid $60 for is $48. So maybe I should have held out a little bit, but you know what? If you want some of these prices, uh, I would for sure check them out. I'll put the uh, link below for you to check them out. But for sure, tell them that 915 Mang did a video and show is told you guys about that. So maybe I can get the hookup later on. All right, so enough about that. Check out how I mounted my SPS. What I did do, I used some of that uh, Aquamax reef welder stuff. I heated up the water. Didn't do like Reefer Gill did. I put some gloves on and I mixed these up. Before I put the corals into these this little holders or whatever, I super glued them in place. So that way, you know, the weight of the of the holder is up against the glass. Now my goal is to have off to the right of the tank, have SPS growing against the wall. So it looks cool like this. I think this looks cool, guys. So it looks like this. You know, instead of using the, because I'm running out of room on my frag, on my uh, overflows. And I'm trying to replicate this kind of look with SPS, with some, you know, nice SPS because I am into it. And I want those little frags that I got to grow out like this. Um, so that's going to be pretty cool. Hopefully it works. So far, the uh, little holders that I glued up against the glass have not fallen. So I'm good there. And let's take a look at some of the other SPS that I had originally. You know, some of these were brown and they started to take color like this one off to the right. It's taking color. The one in the middle almost died. And I'm going to show you where it started growing again. And the one on the left was more brown than what it was. And it's starting to take uh, color again. I don't know the names of those. Some of those are from uh, Battle Corals. But uh, they're doing good. And some of them are from Reefer's Garage. Um, the funny thing is that big old pink bird's nest that I have on the bottom actually came from a little frag from Cultivated Reef. And uh, you know what? Let's take a look at some of these nice corals with the uh, blue LED. Now this is why I get into corals because of the Atenix uh, when the blues kick on. You can see all these crazy colors and that's just the uh, beauty of having a reef tank right at your house. I would also like to tell you guys to hit that subscribe button for me. So that way you can see more crazy updates of more corals that I've bought. Um, this one I did have permission from the wife to go ahead and uh, buy some stuff. But you know what? As I get them, I do these videos and I start off with one or two little frags, little heads of uh, polyps or whatever. And you can see, guys, this stuff has grown. It's overtaking the uh, frag disc. I may need to go ahead and cut some more of these guys out. But uh, with that pop that you're seeing right now it is through my little blue flashlight that I highly recommend that you guys get 
my Miami Vice is always right here is doing really good. Um, they opened up right away for me. Uh, so I do like to shop at certain places, certain people, and I'm a returning customer. But um, it's cool to see them uh, grow out. And I'm going to, I'm happy because uh, I got my Hornets again. I got my Red Hornets and I got my uh, Blue Hornets, which I've had before, but uh, they died. Also, another thing, guys, um, I went to Phoenix. Some of you know that. Follow me on Instagram. I was able to see the Blue Angels flying around. And I'm going to finish this video up Hell with yeah. you guys uh, just checking them out. If you guys want to see that, kick back and enjoy a little bit of flight time. Thanks, guys. Make sure you guys subscribe. Take care. Here they come, guys. Oh, hell, that's gonna be a good fly by, too, dude. Hell yeah. Here they Boom. Come. It's a show.
Thanks for watching guys. I hope you guys didn't mind that flight time. You guys have a good one. Take care. Like, subscribe. Hit them up for those sales. And uh, make sure you tell them I sent you. Laters.